I'm ready. Welcome into the Media Center here at the JTBC Classic presented by Barbasol. We're here with defending champion MB Park. A year ago we were here. It was a five-shot win. Uh, you finished at 14 under, and it was quite a commanding performance. What are the vibes being back um, this week? You know, I you know love this area, um, and obviously with the you know good memories of last year, I I'm really happy to be here. I played nine holes yesterday, and it really reminded me of last year. You know how I played, and you know how tough these greens were. It reminded me. So um, yeah, really happy to be back here. The weather's great, and you know golf course is in a in a great. Form. So, um, yeah, glad to be here. The golf course, I mean, how well does it set up for your game? Um, I think, you know, this golf course really suits me well. Um, you know, it's just the greens that really gets a lot of people um, this week, and that's what I'm trying to, um, you know, minimize my mistakes on the greens. Um, greens are very tough, and, you know, they're Poana greens, so they're not consistent. So you have to um, watch your speed um, really well this week, and, um, you know, don't, be, don't get too frustrated even if you miss little, you know, shorter putts this week. Um, I think we're going to see a lot of that this week. Last time we saw you was in on the Asian swing um, back in the States. What's the last few weeks been like for you getting back, uh, getting back over here? I'm still, you know, a little bit struggling with the jet lag. I came over to the States last um, Thursday, so I had about three, three days in, in a Vegas home and then drove over here. So um, you know, still adjusting a little bit, but, um, you know, I feel good. Um, you know, the, like I said, the, I really love this area. The weather is great. And, um, yeah, I think I'm going to enjoy this week. As far as your game goes, what have you been kind of working on? I think the last time you've um, played, it was mm -hmm. a T-17 finish, pretty solid. I mean, what have you been kind of working on to get ready for this week? Um, you know, I, I'm really trying trying to, you know, improve my game on the greens this um, this this year in general. Um, you know, I feel like I've been, you know, striking the ball pretty consistently. Um, just, you know, the range, you know, range putts inside like six feet. That's that's where I am kind of trying to get a little better on. Um, just the shorter putts. Um, I think I need to make more of them to score well. So um, yeah, that's about it. How does it feel to be back here defending defending a title? Yeah, it feel if I feel good and. Um, like I said, you just got to watch out and how, how you putt on these greens. And that's about, you know, what what it really takes on this golf course. Um, you know, minimize the three putts, um, minimize the short putt misses this week. That's um, That will be the key. Awesome. Ken? What have been the drills you've worked on to work on your short game coming into this week? Um, you know, I'm not really a player who, like, demonstrates a lot of the drills or anything like that. I really re rely on my feel a lot. Um, yeah, I just try to spend a lot of time on the greens and just um, uh, trying to get my confidence up by, you know, seeing and uh, making a lot of the short putts on the putting green, um, trying to um, have the consistent stroke, consistent rhythm um, whenever I uh, practice. Have you made any changes to your bag coming into this week? No. <laughs> same, same thing. Um, I I changed one of the hybrids to the newer model. That's about it. What was the newer model? Uh, the Axio, the Axio hybrid. I used the older one, but um, I changed to the newer model this year. <laughs> and you joined Instagram recently with. I did. Yeah. Well, what led you to join, and how did you come up with the username? Um, you know, I think my, one of my fan. Um, Na uh, nicknamed me unbelievable, so I thought that was pretty, you know, pretty um, good nickname. So I really liked it. And then um, this year, you know, a lot of my friends were just, you know, asking me why are you not on the Instagram? I mean, whole sixteen years on tour, I was never on Instagram. So, you know, I I had it for Instagram for um, like a year or so, a long time ago, but my um, account got hacked. So I after that, I decided, okay, I just won't do it. And then um, this year. I don't know why, I mean, after 16 years, I decided to just have some fun. What's been your favorite part of it? Um, just seeing a lot of people and, you know, getting being able to talk to a lot of the old friends that I really never got in touch with. And, um, you know, seeing a lot of people, you know, what they do in their life and everyday life. Um, I think there's a lot of information that, you know, I really didn't know about. So, yeah, it's a, it's a cool SNS life, I guess. It's been nice to see you yeah. up there, too. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. Awesome. So we'll go to Beth Ann on the Zoom. Beth Ann, you can unmute your mic. Hey, NB. I just Hi. followed you on Instagram. So <laughs> okay. <I'm excited>. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, I, I want to talk, looking ahead a little bit, um, what are your emotions like and, and how are you mentally preparing for next week? 
For um, obviously, you know, next week we'll be we'll be playing um, in the Chevron Championship for the last year in Mission Hills. So um, I'm a little bit sad and li happy at the same time. I'm excited to be playing next week. Um, obviously, we're gonna see a little bit of a you know different green next week than this week. But um, I think just the just about um, just getting ready to the first major of the year is just a really exciting thing. And I started the season much earlier than the usual, so I don't feel like I am so rusty or, um, you know, I feel like I'm warmed up now. So um, I think I'm ready to play. Was that done on purpose with, with the next week in mind, starting earlier? Uh, no, I mean, I, I wouldn't say it was the next week in mind, but I wanted to go back to see Rio a little one, one more time. So I to do that, I think I had to play the three weeks first and then take some time off after that. So Rio was in my mind, <laughs> if I I, to be to be honest, yeah. <laughs> I love it. Mm -hmm. um, and, and just one more about, about putting. Obviously, last year you had a, a, a great time on these greens. Mm -hmm. But how do you uh, mentally, you know, if, if you get frustrated this week at some point, not let that spill into next week where it's very different. Yeah, I mean, this week you can't really take it personally on the greens, <laughs> I don't think. <laughs> um, you know, I remember, uh, you know, a couple of years when I four-putted on these greens and, you know, I... It, I mean, as hard as it is, um, I just got to keep saying that uh, it wasn't you who four-putted. I think it was the greens. And, um, you know, it is hard to, um, you know, go like that. But I, you know, that's what I try. I try to, to be patient. Um, just think that if something's not going well, just think that it's not you putting on these greens. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'm not, I'm just trying to, you know, have the right speed. So no matter what, um, you know, what distance, distance you're putting from, I try to tap in. So, you know, what I concentrate on is just getting the speed right. So the next putt is not a problem. So that, um, that strategy worked well last year. So I think that I'm going to stick with that strategy. Very good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So as Bethan mentioned, going to be playing a lot of California golf. Um, coming from the Asian swing to here, I know you were home in Vegas for a couple of days. How different and how challenging is it to adjust to this kind of style of golf? You know, I, you know, the one of the reasons I started the season earlier was that um, I love the golf courses that we play earlier in the year um, than the later in the year. So um, I've, I thought that the earlier in the season fits me a lot more. And obviously, we we're going to play some Poana greens and um, got to be a little bit patient. But the, um, co the overall weather is a little bit drier than the what we play in the summertime. So the course is playing a little bit shorter than the middle of the year swings. So I think that's really what gonna be fitting me better than the um later in the year so yeah um I think I have been playing I have played well in the west coast um golf courses so I think I think that's why I scheduled this way <laughs> awesome well I'm sure it will be an unbelievable week <laughs> thank for you, you. <laughs> uh, thanks yeah. for joining us we appreciate it thank Love you